By the way, they're both nervous. No, no. This you got to know. <laughs> this you got to know. They're nervous. I'm happy that you're here. Thank you. We'll see how long that we lasts. We are happy to be here. Oh, good. For now. All right. For now. <laughs> Start running your lines. Okay. Um, Uncross your legs. So what's this about? We're in a bar. And okay, I may take that out. Go ahead. Let's run your lines. It would be funny if I just left. Khaled. Khaled. <laughs> Khaled. Victor, hi. How are you doing? Uh, you're, you're alone? Yeah, can you believe they sat me on the table your, for six? Uh, separate your ch uh, chairs and you go for the off this way. Khaled. Victor, hi. How are you doing? You're uh, alone. Yeah, can you believe they sat me at this table for six? <laughs> and this dump, you deserve a table for ten. Eh. I um, thought Brenda might be here. She left. Oh, so I, I, I missed her. Yeah, had to go. Has okay, a call so tomorrow. Um, this is like a casual thing? Or it's like, um, what? Well, I've, I've manipulated him into coming here. Why? I'm an, I'm an actor and he's a writer. Why? So that I can get my part to be bigger. How badly do you want to be an actress? So bad. Good. So bad. Now your whole body just changed. You see? <laughs> you see? Her, her face flushed and her whole body got, okay? Look at you. And now you're much more pretty. Oh. So you're hiding. Oh. Well, it's not all. <laughs> so how good is she? Eh. No way to play it. To be in the, in the moment, you have to make a choice that's hot, right? So wouldn't a better choice, your talent being in your choices, wouldn't the best choice be you were one of the great actors of all time? It would be the best choice, but it's not How do the you case know? in the script. How do you know? Oh. By the way, the people oh. who are not good actors never know they're not good actors. <laughs> uh. they're, they're, oh, right. They're the, you know, you, you know, um, you know? <laughs> You, know, you understand what I mean? Colette. Victor, hi. How are you doing? Uh, you're, you're alone. Yeah, they sat me at a table for six. And this dump, you deserve a table for okay, ten. Okay, it's weird. Um, <laughs> let's, uh, no, it's good, it's good, it's good. It's just weird. Um, um, it's good. It's good. Come in again. Colette. Colette. Victor, hi. How you doing? Don't worry about it. Just kiss him. Don't worry about it. Huh? Kiss, kiss him. Kiss him? I kiss him like a, pers a person. Like a person? Oh. oh. You're How here. You uh, there you go. What does that do? Come on, come on, come on. You're here come alone. On. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what Six. I have here is a good girl. Okay? So on her script, you write good girl. And she, I'm going to tell her as the director to in today's rehearsal to break good girl four times on every page. Good girl. So you do four actions now that are against good girl. That are against good girl? Yeah. Okay. Now, now do you want to do this today or do you want me to? I'm here. Well, then do it. All right. Here we go. Four this is, by the way, life is, break. life is made out of moments, right? Like realistic actions to break good girl? Whatever. Like you, can, you, can, you can fart. I don't care. <laughs> I don't care. You can do anything you want. By the way, what she's doing is very good right now. <laughs> that, but she would never do it in the scene. Say your first line. Uh, Victor, hey, how you doing? Hey, hey, hey. You understand? How are you doing? Now say it like a siren. Say it like a hooker. <laughs> Victor, hey, how you doing? Why not? <laughs> I don't know. Why not? Maybe that's their deal. Okay. Now say it. Say it. Uh, uh, say it like uh, you're drunk. Hey, no, Victor, how you doing? That's southern. <laughs> Uh, southern <laughs> comfort, sort of. <laughs> Come on, Cookie, let's go. Uh, Victor, <laughs> hi, how you doing? Good. Go ahead. Do I get to be drunk too? You, whatever you want. Ah, <laughs> uh, <laughs> you're you're here alone. Yeah. Eh. Can you believe these guys? They sat me at a table for six. Yeah. Nobody else is here. And a girl. That's two. <laughs> and the. Yeah, you got one more coming up. In this dump, you deserve a, a table for ten. Oh, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I, uh, I thought Brenda... Perfect. Now you're in the scene. 
<laughs> because you've dropped. Hold on. Now, I've got to tell you what's just happened. They dropped the story. And now they're in the scene. Are they doing it correctly? I actually don't care. I kind of think they are. But she's now in her mode. You understand? Will this photography ever stop? Because what if I'm an epileptic? I mean, you know, I'm like dead. Um, OK, so do you, did you feel that? Yeah. Absolutely. Did you feel it? Oh, yeah. And so this, the, the, the thing, <laughs> what are they going to say? No, I didn't feel it. I, I didn't. Um, so then what they've done is drop the whole story. The script is going to do itself. And they're now having fun. And they're playing like my little four-year-old and my two-year-old. And they're going to explore. My kids don't go, oh, that's over, over the top. That's quite, I'm not connected there. Um, I'm not, you know, I didn't get your eyes on that thing. Um, you want to do over the shoulder on that? They, they, they play with a ferocity. So that's all we want to do today. Tomorrow we'll rehearse. But today we're going to explore. Okay? I think you're kind of holding on to something. So I'm on, I want to do a little th uh, thing. All right. Uh, okay, we're in, uh, this is in a big sound stage, okay? Go over there. You guys are doing great. Give them a hand. They're doing great, right? Colette. Colette. Victor! How you doing? Why, why, why can't I get you to get out? Go, go over, go overboard. Colette! Why not? Colette! Victor! How are you? You're alone. <laughs> but they sat me at a table for six. <laughs> in, in this dump, you deserve a table for ten. <laughs> hey, I thought Brenda might be here. Perfect. Keep going. Don't worry about it. Go ahead. Go ahead. I thought Brenda might be here. Nope, she left. That Bradley is on my fucking back. Okay, don't worry about it. Just get down doing, uh, uh, doing uh, uh, push-ups now for the next part of this. Go you, ahead. Do you, you want me to do push-ups? Well, I don't want to do push-ups. <laughs> I don't blame you. And tell that to the producers. Bradley's on my back. Good. Perfect. Yeah, what about? Length. Oh. Now do sit-ups. Go ahead. Jesus, come on. Come on. Uh, Life. You, you have beautiful hair. Uh, I do? Yeah. You know, Brenda, she's in love with you. Ah, get out of here. You, have you ever gotten hurt or, or embarrassed because you've been too much? Have you ever been embarrassed because you've been over much or too much? Everybody in the room has, so don't worry about it. Yeah, yeah, I'm sure I have. Uh huh. Well, here you can stick a pin in it. Fuck them. Okay? Right here, today. That's what you dedicate this scene about. Am I making sense to you? I think so. Okay, is it I think so or am I making sense to you? Yeah, you're making sense. Okay, now is it yeah or is it yeah? Yeah! That's right. And, and there's, no, there's no honor lost in being uh, excited and uh, uh, emotional and passionate about something. No honor lost. Colette. Colette. Ah, that's great. No, no, that's great. And don't do your takes and don't do anything. That's great. I love it. And if you see that on the set, as soon as the actor makes a change, you jump on him and say, that's the ticket. Do you understand me? That was hard what he just did. He just knocked off the bullshit. The whole story, the whole song, he went, fuck it. Great. Again. Colette. Colette. Victor, how you doing? You're alone? Yeah, they sat me at a table for six. In this dump, you deserve a table for ten. I thought Brenda was going to be here. Yeah, she left. You know, that's terrific what you're doing. That's terrific. Your talent is in your point of view. And you, I see as an artist, forgive me, is you're kind of watching where your point of view goes. You got to use spice. You got to you got to use yourself. This guy's a motherfucker, but he's holding it. He's just like, you know, I don't want to be I don't want I don't want to give you all myself. When's the last time you lost your temper? Really lost it. Oh. Definitely involves my my brother. Okay. Good. I want you to reenact it even if you indicate it, even if it's not believable. Yeah. Colette, a little more. Colette, a little more. Colette, a little more. Colette. Victor how how are you doing? You're here alone? Yeah, they sat me at a table for six. Yeah, in this dump, you deserve a table for ten. Okay, let me ask you, why can't he come in like that? Have you ever been behind on a script? Have you ever had that? Have you ever been when they're all over you? So he's angry, 
You want to fuck him. Let's go. It's like we're directing a porn movie. <laughs> do you understand what I'm trying to do? I'm trying to break it. I'm trying to destroy it. I'm trying to get it to them to do it badly. They're trying to do it well. We're all trying to be liked in this world, and we're not getting anything done. Four people just wrote it down, trying to be liked. <laughs> in this world, try not to be liked. Colette! Oh, I love it. Colette! Yes! Victor? You're here alone. They sat me at a table for six. In this dump, you deserve a table for ten. <laughs> I thought Brenda might be here. Yeah, she... Hi, girl. She left. So I missed her. Yeah, she had to go. She had a call. Yeah, I know. I've been writing, ce I've been writing scenes on the back Perfect. of the call sheet. Good. Hmm. You're writing new scenes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tinkering. I'm toying. Do you feel what's going on? Do you feel the emotion? Of course. It's right there. It's beautiful. Who knows, no. who knows what's going to come of it? Look at that. Well, you've written a great script. I mean, it's chunky. Tell that to the producers. Yeah, and you're right. Your impulse is right. Bradley. Is do it my, again. Bradley. No, is no. On my do it back. again. When she goes to you, you're absolutely right. You're perfect, which gets her going. I like the scene. I like it. There's something in it. I don't understand it. But you know what? I'm sick of understanding shit. Aren't you? Go, it's so clear. <laughs> My life, is your life clear? My life is not clear. I got, is that my phone? I thought it was my pacemaker. <laughs> um, how you doing? Good. It's fun. Good? Good or good? I'm doing fucking great, Jeffrey. No, no, no. no but Talk to me. How you doing? I'm doing good. Doesn't it feel powerful? Yeah. Now, do you think it's too much? Do you think it's too much for the scene? Oh, no. Maybe. It doesn't matter what you think. <laughs> <laughs> That's all. Because we're just playing. No one's going to bother you. I, I, I can see you. You're great. And he's gulping. You see? He's in. It's great. You've got to give this. If you were in my acting class, you, you would be frightened to see me. Because I'd be all over your ass. <laughs> because you have such talent. You're doing great. Okay? I don't quite believe you want to fuck him. Hmm. Okay. Remember when we were little kids and we used to say, This is for you, Herbie, and I mean it. <laughs> you can mean it a little more. <laughs> we won't do anything. Don't worry. We won't even tell. Doesn't matter. Hey, it's a great script. It's chunky. Tell it to the producers. You know, Bradley is on my back. That's good. What about? Go back to Bradley, and that's on my back. And um, Jesus Christ. Uh, and uh, <laughs> you need to, a Valium, my friend. Uh, you're doing so good. I can't stand it. I can't stand what you're doing. Both of you, you're great. Um, I have a woman who lives across the street from me on 102nd and, and uh, Broadway, and she comes out every morning, and she goes out, I'm going to yell, uh, and she comes out every morning, and she looks through her trash and goes, God damn it! God damn it! <laughs> and then she goes back into her house. <laughs> and no one says, you know, that's a little bit over the top. <laughs> you understand? Her life at that moment is there's, she has no fucking money and there's nothing in the, in the trash can. So she goes back and waits for the next morning, you understand? Let her be the same. Go over much in the day. Um, let's do it very badly now, using the anger. Let's do the scene not well and badly and badly acted, but not badly, over a hundred times, okay? Mm -hmm. I've been writing scenes on the back of the call sheet! Hey, you're writing new scenes. <laughs> <laughs> Look, <laughs> it's none of your business! It's none of your business! <laughs> Don't 
don't do that. Stop it. <laughs> Hey, hey, you're great. Can we cut for you're a second? You're great. Now let me ask you, directors, would you keep that in? That he broke up? Well, someone answer, please. Yeah. Yes, you would. Why? It was real. And we do do that, right? Yeah. So I would put that in, right? So that's an accident because it's, ex it's excellent. So anybody have trouble with it? We, we put that in? Yeah, Mike Lee would put it in. You have trouble? No. We put it in. <laughs> oh, we, we would put it in. In partnership, it's in. We're going to put it in. <laughs> We're actually filming this now, and you're making a film for us. That's hysterical. So what we've done is we broke the glass. The actor has to step on the glass and shatter it to get to, to, what, you know, to what's in the scene. You look great. I was watching last night in my room before I went off to sleep. Um, the Shining. It is definitely, when you watch this film, you, are in, you know that you are in the hands of a director. You do know that he made, uh, that he actually framed, here's Johnny, just perfectly. You, you understand? And let Jack Nicholson do his improvisation within that frame. You are absolutely sure that there is a hands-on director. You don't want, oh, do whatever you want. You'll, you'll die. See you next time.